make them hit a running backhand passing shot. So here's me serving. Andrew's the one returning here. And I went for this out wide serve here on the deuce side here. And I got Andrew to get pulled off the court here. And notice I have big amount of space, right? I could, I could choose to hammer this straight through with my backhand topspin. But sometimes you don't really need to do that, right? You don't need to be rushed. You don't always need to just hammer top spins all day. And what I did was I just sliced it. I just sliced it to the backhand side of Andrew here and made Andrew play a running backhand passing shot. And it's always tough to do a running backhand passing shot. If you're going to go down the line here, right, you're going to go over the high part of the net. And also, I'm approaching towards this side, right? If you're going to go with a backhand cross-court passing shot, you need to be there a little bit early enough so that you could at least flick it cross-court. Definitely possible to do that off the backhand. But remember, you're running all the way from here to the other side of the court. And there's, you know, there's this rush, right? There's this urgency or there's this, um, you know, pressure. Pressure basically to hit a good shot off of this backhand. And actually, Andrew almost got it. So he went with this down the line and it just clipped the net cord here. And that's where all the inches of the net on that side of the court was very helpful for me. So even though I didn't hit a, you know, a, a blazing topspin winner here, what did I do? I just went with a, a slice, a slice that hopefully goes deep, right? If it goes deep, then that's a very good shot. I just went with a slice and, you know, I pressured Andrew into forcing the air. So a lot of the times in tennis, you don't need blazing winners. You don't need super hard, fast top spin shots. You just need to make a good play, make a good slice, make a good shot that goes deep. It could be even medium pace. And making them run for a backhand passing shot is always a good play. Maybe they'll get it, maybe not. But it's a high percentage play for you if you can execute that tactic. If you enjoyed this video, kindly do me a favor and hit that like and subscribe button. As always, thanks for watching and I'll see you next time.